Hey y'all, Mrs. Do Nine is back with another video. Um, today our video is going to be titled What Were You Thinking? These are some pretty dumb people. I'll I'll just go ahead and say dumb. Um we're gonna look at these and see what happens. So here we go. Okay. This first one. You're next. Except they spelled your. It should be Y-O-U apostrophe R-E. And they don't have enough fingers for that. Y-O-U apostrophe R-E. Oh yeah, they would. N-E-X-T. They'd have enough fingers. Look at that. I miscounted a while ago when I counted those. So yeah. They'd have enough fingers. They just didn't spell it right. Okay, the super bowel. I'm not sure I want to go to that. Um, I, they added an extra, or not an extra, because there's not any E's in bowl itself. But yeah, they put a, a E in there where there wasn't supposed to be one. And um, yeah, it turned out super bowel. They must be... Um, celebrating a, a very big, momentous um, bathroom visit would be my guess. Okay, dude. I don't even know what this dude is doing, but it does not look safe. And um, I'm not sure he's going to make it. I'm guessing, this is just a guess. I'm going to guess and predict. I wish this was a video because this would be, I want to see the end of it. I'm going to guess that when he goes to go over this fence or whatever this thing is, that when he gets on those, oh, uh, whatever those are, it looks like metal ramps maybe, that it's just going to either, the, the, the ramps are going to go from this to this, or he's just going to fall off of them. I really wish this was a video because I'd really like to see what happens. But this is not a smart move. Okay. This is a dog, correct? Y'all see the dog, right? And y'all, I'm fixing to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. I know I make the most horrible faces when I sneeze, but I'm sorry. I am sick again. Two inches thick pollen on my car. Not a good day. Anyway, y'all don't want to hear about that. Okay, y'all see this dog, right? You, you see the dog. Because this is a dog. Um, and it's a pillow, looks like. And it's Prince Kitty. Or Princess. It's probably Princess. Because it's pink with a pink bow. So we're going to go with Princess. Still be a princess, but it's not a kitty. It's a dog. So I'm wondering if it's the the Princess Kitty is the name of the company that makes the pillow or either they've got some really um, not so smart people working in their marketing department and their uh, whatever you want to call it. Not really marketing because it wouldn't be marketing. What would it? Uh, their factories that are putting the pictures onto the, the things that they're sending out because that's not a cat. That's a dog. <laughs> Oh, why is that? Okay, y'all. Y'all tell me what's wrong with this picture. Oh, I see what's wrong with the picture. The pictures are right. Orange with an orange and a grape with a grape. Except they've switched the juice. I was going to say there is nothing wrong with this picture. And I was going to be wrong because there is something wrong with this picture. This should be above the orange and this should be above the grape that's just people not paying attention to what they're doing okay y'all I don't know if you can see it or not but this picture is of a car driving down a very busy interstate highway roadway like there's like four lanes of traffic there's cars coming up behind them. There's cars in front of them, I'm assuming, because who took this picture? 
Um, I believe this is in California. I believe that's what that tag says. If y'all can see that, comment down below and let me know because I think it says California, which is full of stupid people. We all know. They are driving with those, oh, uh, the sun, um, sun, what do you call them? The sun visor things? It's not really a visor, though. It's the, the sun deflectors that you put in your windshield, like you put inside on your windshield when you get out of your car on a very hot day. It's supposed to deflect the sun to keep your car a little bit cooler so it's not 350 degrees when you get in there in the middle of the summer like it is down here. Um, but these are supposed to deflect the heat, but you're not supposed to drive with them in your windshield because they completely block your windshield. This is not a good idea. This is an example of something that is not a good idea. We do not want to be doing this, but since these people live, and again, I think it says California, um, I think we're going to give them a pass because again, California is full of crazy people. Just say it. people please 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 check your spelling when you're gonna put something on the side of your car that you're gonna be driving down the road that people are gonna see every day that you drive it and probably every day anyway because this looks like they live in a neighborhood where they have to park on the street so people are going to be seeing this we need to do spell check this is a piece of something not like, peace, y'all. This is a piece of something, like a piece of pie or a piece of cake. This is a piece of crap car, now that you've done this to it. Just saying. If you agree, comment down below. <sighs> Seriously. This is just lazy. And... I don't, I don't know what to say about this one because this is just lazy. They, they've, they've, they're painting the line on the road or on the sidewalk. It looks like down the side of a sidewalk, apparently. Either that or this car is pulled in a very wrong direction. But anyway, they're painting a white line down the side. I, I think it is the road, and I think, I think the road's going like this, and the car's just pulled in like this, and it shouldn't be. So there is that. The car shouldn't be pulled there. But, again, you just skip that piece or you um, try to find the owner of the car, possibly, if there's a lot of people around, you know, maybe in one of the stores or whatever this is, wherever this is at. Um, but you don't paint across the top of somebody's car. This is called a lawsuit. These people are probably going to get a lot of money from this city because their city workers are not very intelligent. Taxpayer money that's going to be spent paying some idiot. Okay, moving on. Heavy Detui. Detui. I'm not even sure what that says. And it's supposed to be D U T Y, duty. That goes along with your super bowel cake up there. Sorry. <laughs> Duty. <laughs> That's a Chandler joke. Y'all just have to watch Friends. Sorry. I'll quit. Detui. Detui. I don't know if people... I don't... I don't think people actually stand there and stamp each letter onto these tools. But whoever set the letters in the little press thing needs to learn how to spell. Again, several of these, um, four pictures out of the 10 pictures. So four out of 10 um, really need to go back to school and learn how to spell. And these are simple, like first grade, second grade words. Let's, let's, yeah, they just need to go back. And last but not least, I think the most unintelligent of them all is this guy who is welding shooting sparks of flame at the actual tanks that hold the gases that are allowing him to weld whatever it is he's welding this is not good because spark gas boom again i wish this was a video 
And I wish it would blow up. Not hurt the guy. Don't. Don't go saying I want the guy to blow up and to blow into pieces. No, no, no. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is it needs to just kind of blow a little bit and kind of scare the mess out of him. See another, another, um, scare the duty out of him. Another super bowel <laughs> joke. <laughs> this dude's getting on, I am telling you. And if it does blow, it's going to go boom, like a huge boom. And he probably would be blown to pieces. So let's not, I, I don't wish that anymore, I don't guess. Because I don't want the guy to get hurt. I just want him to learn his lesson. So anyways, y'all, that is the last video or the last video. See, again with this, the last picture in this video that I've just recorded um, I am so sorry it's so short. I'm so sorry I'm not kind of chipper or more chipper, but I really don't feel good. I know y'all could hear it. I'm trying not to make gross sounds while I'm doing this. So if I do, I apologize. But anyway, thank y'all for watching. I hope y'all liked it. Again, as always, go subscribe, like, hit the big thumbs up for me, like it, share it with your friends and family. Hit that bell so that you know when I put up a new video, it will go ding ding and remind you that I have put up a new video. I love y'all so much and I will see y'all next time. Bye y'all.